Good morning, everyone. My name is Cleone Natasha Crawford. I'm the founder of Only Cleone and Cleone Digital, Resilient Minds 365 and Happy Home 42 and many more. So I have many titles, but the most important title today is I am an activist and advocate for mental health. So I'm the one who wrote the, who started the petition three weeks ago to get justice for DeFonte Miller. Honestly, ladies and gentlemen, I am so proud of our village. Not just the blacks, not just black people, but people of all races, because we live in a multicultural country. And not even just Amer Canadians, but Americans and people across the globe that decided that, you know what? We want justice and we want it now. No more waiting. So after three years of waiting for DeFonte Miller, I've never met DeFonte Miller in my life, but I, I was passionate about his case because I understand what it feels like to be someone with PTSD and possibly anxiety now, you know, anxious because of police. He's probably scared out of his mind. Doesn't want to have to deal with this. You know, three years of waiting for justice. But guess what, guys? I got good news, very good news. This Friday, June the 26th at 9.30 a.m., justice will be served. The Honorable Joseph DeLuca will, will be making a judgment on the case for DeFonte Miller to the officers and brother, Christian and Michael Thoreau. You should be proud of yourself. Because your signatures went a long way. Because when I went to Ottawa and I submitted those signatures, we were at 55,000 signatures. That was after one week of the petition. Now, guys, we and gals, <laughs> we are at almost 134,000 signatures. It's amazing. It's amazing what can happen when the people and the village comes together and says, no. We will not tolerate this longer. We want justice and we want it now or else because DeFonte Miller can't see in one eye because of this brutal attack. So I wanna encourage you all to continue fighting, continue signing and even contact, now that you know the name of the justice, the judge that will be, you know, his name is Joseph DeLuca. I will be putting the details in the in this chat, in this video, so that you can feel free to find him, contact him, and flood his inbox, his email, with letters saying, we want justice, and we want it now. You're not gonna let these two hooligans who call themselves police officer and accomplice, brother, get away with this. If that doesn't, if we don't get the justice that we deserve for DeFonte Miller, you think we're gonna sit back? Hell no. We want it, we want it now. They deserve to go to jail. They don't deserve any other things but jail. Jail, jail, jail. Put them in jail, judge them. Make there be a precedent. Let that come through. Because DeFonte Miller has one eye because of these two people, Michael and Christian. Christian? He's not even, a, come on. He doesn't even wear the word, the name Christian. He puts a, he puts a that man, you know what it takes to be a Christian? It means to be a Christ-like person. I'm not saying that this is all about religion or whatever but he doesn't even wear his name. So he doesn't deserve, he doesn't deserve to be free. They don't deserve to be free. They deserve jail, jail, put them in jail. Let them feel what it feels like to be a jail bird. And continue to show support to DeFonte Miller's family by donating to his GoFundMe, which I'll put in the description as well. His goal is 90,000. If, if every single one of you would donate $1 today, $1, 
we would have made our goal because we have 134,000 of you. So with that said, justice will be served, my friends, and the dish served well cold. And I'm excited, super, uber excited. So this Friday, June 26th at 9.30 a.m., justice will be served. Watch the live stream and you will see it for yourself. Peace and love. This is Cleone Crawford signing out. New activists and, for, and previous and current mental health advocate. God bless you. Bye-bye.